in 2017, um, I asked my husband for a divorce. And within that process, um, we were both living in the same house um, and things started to go bad. And I ended up having to get a restraining order and have him removed from the house. Prior to that, he was not paying the utility bills for months. So when I had him removed from the house, I was stuck with like six months worth of bills. Um, some were only four months, others were six months, and gas was one of them, and I was not working. I had put myself through school. I put myself through CNA. I put myself through patient care technician schooling, um, but I was not working yet. So I had no funds, I had no money, I had no family, no friends, no support, no assistance. So when I got the notice for the shut off on the gas on my door, I called the numbers and got the resources and everything else and I went in and I filed for heating assistance. Had I not done that, my bill at the time was 600 and some dollars um, for my heating and I had nowhere to get that money. And if I would not have gone in and applied for heating assistance, me and my children would have been without heat um, for quite some time because I would have had to find income and a job, which I didn't have because I didn't have child care. So with that being said, I went in, I applied, and it was so helpful and beneficial because I was able to get my heat turned back on, which was off for three days, I believe, is what it was. And it was in the coldest days of the year that we had this year in, in Georgia. Um, and it was kind of crazy because it affected my water as well because I couldn't have hot water to cook. I couldn't have hot water to shower or bathe my kids. So without it, me and my kids would have been, you know, in a bad way. So the process was pretty easy. I went in, you know, just told them my story, told them what was going on, filled out the application. They were pretty quick about getting everything processed for me. Um, called the gas company, told them that this is the amount that they had for me and they were gonna be paying and did a promise to pay date. Um, and within, I think, two days or so after that, my gas was turned back on. So that's pretty much my story. I mean, if, if, I, if this program and the assistance was not out there, single moms like me who are struggling with small children in the house and have no support system, me and my kids wouldn't have had the heat and the water that we needed.